uh, this is a demonstration on how an output of an audio signal can be uh, transmitted through a laser system and then into a radio where you could where that can recover the audio signal. This technique involves FM uh, demodulation and I'm first going to describe the system to you and then we'll see a demonstration. The laser beam comes out of the laser through a half wave plate to a polarizer beam splitter. The polarized beam splitter branches the laser beam into two branches. One goes through an acoustic optomodulator and the second goes through uh, a quarter wave plate through an objective lens to the surface of a piezoelectric crystal. You see some wires on the crystal. They are being, being vibrated by the audio from the computer. The second branch goes through uh, acoustic optic modulator and that is frequency shifted by 80 megahertz and it combines through a series of beams at the beam splitter right where my ruler is from the piezoelectric crystal and from the and the acoustic optic modulator uh, are split by a beam splitter and then they are detected by a, a balanced photoreceiver balanced photoreceiver uh, takes the, the phase difference between these two beams and amplifies it and converts it into a voltage that you can see on the oscilloscope. The frequency is varying on the oscilloscope. This is because of the shift in the, of the Doppler shift caused by a piezoelectric crystal. So we have CBC radio on right now. And that's coming out of the speaker of the laptop. So now I'm going to connect this to the audio output of the computer. And this is causing a frequency shift in that beam. You cannot detect it very well visually, but you can detect it when you do the demodulation on that on that signal. Because this frequency shifted is 80 megahertz plus around 50 kilohertz. Now this is a radio that's tuned to 80 megahertz. The advantage of an optical system is so you get no electrical interference because the signals are being transmitted through lasers and light pulses. Now we're going to cause optical experience interference in the single. Now, if you're not convinced by this, we're going to change the song. <laughs> 